Polarization, the division into two sharply contrasting groups or set of opinions or beliefs. Now, Braver Angels concerns itself with the crisis that's known as effective polarization, where disagreements become toxic. We start to demonize the person. The Braver Angels ways doesn't actually seek to try to change people's minds on issues. You know, we just want to be able to calmly and respectfully discuss the concerns and ideas that are facing our communities. And what is the personal cost of polarization? Now there's a bunch of words and stats I could read off here, but I think on this one, all I really need to do is just take a moment of silence here to feel the effect of polarization in our own lives and in our country. So what, what is the personal effect of polarization in our country? I don't think I have to say anything more. You wouldn't be here. You wouldn't be watching this right now if that didn't answer that question. But there's good news. There's good news. I believe we have more in common than we think. The Braver Angel Ways is not about trying to change political opinions. Instead, it teaches us how to listen and how to learn how someone came to their particular views, their life experiences, and their values to seek common ground where it exists, and to speak honestly and without fear otherwise. See, we are all leaders in this grassroots movement. So we all have access to the same tools that Braver Angels is providing us. And my job as an ambassador is to help you be aware of what those tools are and how you personally might want to get involved in the organization. And they've got a ton of different ways to do it. And the first principle of Braver Angels is equal participation of red and blue leading Americans at all levels of leadership in the organization. Now this is really important. Success requires overlapping networks working together to achieve these shared goals. So the goal, of course, is to move ourselves clockwise on this chart. And we're committed to equal representation in the network of Braver Angel partners because including these strong representations and these independent, nonpartisan voices, I mean, this is the mix that we need in our communities and our community organizations. A lot of that for me is, is just by having social time together. Juggling clubs, I want to start uh, an activity for Braver Angels to having a juggling club where we just come in and we, you know, we don't talk politics, we juggle. <laughs> Uh, there are many ways to experience Braver, Braver Angels. Here we go. We've got e-courses. Now these are professional level courses and they've been crafted by experts in communication and depolarizing. These courses can be taken standalone and they're generally about 40 minutes each. Debates. These are our special parliamentary uh, format and it encourages everyone to speak and to ask questions. These are online too. We have them in person. Uh, if you're interested in helping us get a debate going, there's another way you can get involved. One-on-one -on -one conversations. Now this is, um, this is a novel way. It's not all that novel. What's novel about one-on-one -on -one conversation? Then the ambassador program. This is something that's just growing now. This is something I'm hoping to be able to help Braver Angels with. And we are all ambassadors, ambassadors for this depolarizing movement that, that we are hungry for. There are other special interest groups in Braver Angels. There's the Red Caucus. There's the We the People Project that works with working class peoples. There's Angels of Colors. And there's a veterans group. There is a whole bunch of stuff coming into this organization. We get together for film discussions. How do we do this without falling into polarization? Music groups, book clubs. You name it because it's you. It's you putting this stuff together and, and coming into your communities and so other organizations can come in. And not just to get support from us, but to share a common mission. The local alliance invited bipartisan members of our local government and staff and community to come together to support the idea that we can help in our community in a bipartisan, nonpartisan way. This sums up in one picture the diversity of this organization. And you just stare at that for a second. Okay, but we gotta move on. 
because <laughs> that would be a whole hour on its own there. And Braver Song is yet another way for me to get involved in Braver Angels. What is it that you would like to do? What is the first thing you'd like to do? Is it join Braver Angels, post something, sign up to bring Braver Angels into your, your church or your local organization? Because like so many things in life, it's like you work at it, you work at it, you work at it, work, and then it clicks. I think Braver Angels is starting to click. <laughs> Applaud for yourselves. Thanks, everyone.